Hello everyone, my name is Mirko and welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another brand new Apex Legends video and in today's video I'm going to be giving you guys some crucial tips on how to improve your first shot accuracy and I'm going to be showing you guys a really important drill you guys can do in training mode. So I'd just like to take a quick moment to thank everyone for the support we've been getting recently on the channel and if you guys go ahead and enjoy today's video be sure you're dropping a big thumbs up down below and be sure you're subscribing if you're currently not subscribed to the channel. So your first shot accuracy is actually so important and it's more important than some people actually realize because landing your first shot into the opponent is so crucial and it gives you a really good start to the gunfight if you don't land your first bullet into the opponent bearing in mind how the recoil is in this game it's going to give you a really hard time trying to move your sights over to the enemy and line your shots it's like trying to throw a ball of paper into the bin and trying to do it whilst jogging on the spot at the same time with your arms shaking all over the place you're going to find it much more harder to actually throw that ball into the bin and that's the same thing in apex legends if your first shot accuracy isn't that great you're going to find it really hard to actually aim at your enemy with the recoil that your gun's doing so i'm going to show you guys this training drill which is actually so effective and it's something i do about 10 minutes 15 minutes a day before i go on to apex legends it's a nice little warm-up and i'm going to show you guys now how to do this so you want to go into training mode you want to complete the boring beginning challenges that everyone has to do I hope they've released an update so we can just jump straight into training without these tutorials. So you want to pick two weapons of your choice, but you want to make sure of two things. The weapon has over six bullets in ammo capacity, and you also want to make sure that them weapons have a single fire rate mode. So you want to come to this location here, in between the cracks in the floor and between these two targets you can see on screen. Once you're in this position here, the first drill you're going to be doing is you're going to be shooting at the first target here and the last target here. And then after after you shot them two targets you want to move to the ones in the middle and then you want to move to the ones that are closest to each other now i suggest starting off really slowly because you want to make sure you're being as accurate as you can the more you feel comfortable then the more i suggest you start increasing the speed and you're going to be missing shots guys as you can see on screen i'm not perfect i haven't got the most perfect aim and i guarantee if you put a pro player in this drill they're also not going to be 100 percent accurate if you're missing the target quite often you want to check if you're over aiming or under aiming that means if you're aiming past the intended target you might want to lower your sensitivity by one and see how you get on that's the same if you're under aiming and you find yourself not actually reaching to the target then you might want to increase the sensitivity but only if this is a continuous thing once you start doing this for a few minutes you'll start being more accurate the more you go on and although you'll still be missing a few shots here and there you'll still find yourself being fairly confident and you'll start increasing the speed now the second drill is more focused on the smallest of adjustments you might be really close to locking onto the enemy but you might just need to do a slight nudge to the left or a slight nudge to the right to actually be on target with the enemy and this next drill is really going to help you out so you want to be looking at the targets above the targets you've just been shooting at and you're going to start from the left side and you're going to shoot all the way to the right side at these targets and you're just going to keep repeating the same thing one thing i also want to mention as well is once you're comfortable doing this drill you might want to increase the distance between you and the target so if you are shooting at medium to maybe long range then you'll have that sort of training in there as well once you've gone from the left side to the right side a few times then i'll switch up starting from the right side going down to the left side as well so now i've shown you guys the best training method in order to improve your first shot accuracy i'm going to give some further tips of in-game situations where it can really also benefit you so i'm sure a lot of you out there including myself like to enable this panic mode when an enemy is shooting at us and we just want to react so fast so quickly and start shooting at the enemy as soon as possible well over time I've actually learned to stay patient and stay really calm in these situations and just understand that if I'm spamming and shooting at them trying to aim as quickly as possible if anything that's actually going to decrease the chances of me being on target. Now if you find yourself in a situation where an enemy is shooting at you from the side of your screen and you actually have to turn around to be able to shoot back at the enemy you don't want to be engaging at all you want to be running to the closest point of cover because if you turn around and actually engage with the enemy by the time you've actually taken to turn around to point your gun at the enemy it would have already been too late and you would have probably gone down in the meantime but what you guys need to understand when you're engaging with enemies is that your first shot is the only free shot which is going to give you 100% accuracy because there's going to be no recoil on your weapon it's your only chance to line up your gun with the enemy without any recoil stopping you and once you've landed that first shot into the enemy especially if you're using a fully auto weapon the chances of you actually killing the enemy before you have to reload is 
very high. So that's why it's really good and it's really advantageous if you do land that first shot. And when enemies aren't focused on you, be sure you're taking time to line up your shots as your job in downing the enemy will be done much more faster. And as for lining up your shots during a gunfight, this is where the training will really start to kick in because your reaction in lining up your shots will be much more faster after you've been doing the training for quite some time and your reflexes will have just gone up a notch. So anyway guys, I'm going to wrap this video up here. If you guys did go ahead and enjoy today's video and you learned something new, be sure you're dropping a big thumbs up down below and be sure you're leaving a comment letting me know how you get on in the training drill. If you're currently not subscribed to the channel, I'll definitely recommend you do so down below so you don't miss out on any future Apex videos like this one you've seen today. As always, my name's been Mirko and I'll catch all of you guys out in another Apex Legends video. Thanks for watching.